my besties butter is here happy 2020 election day okay happy 2020 election day guys i am here um and i am picking up a pizza for my mom and um, I'm gonna bring it to her and do a quick, quick visit. I have um, to do a double tonight at work. And um, so um, I voted today. So I don't know if you guys know, but I go to work at seven in the morning. So um, this morning I woke up at like 4.30 in the morning. And I don't know, I just seemed kind of antsy. Um, so I got up, got myself together. No, actually, I got up, went to the bathroom, came back, and got back in the bed. And then I laid there. And then Tish texted me. She was like, baby, I'm here at, um, it was about five something at that time. She's like, baby, I'm waiting, um, and I'm waiting in the, um, oh, God, the parking lot of the school. I said, what time is it? He's like, 5.15. I said, you're early. So, um, she was really early because she has to be to work at 7.45. So, um, I was like, dad, yeah, it's really early or whatever. And she was like, yeah, I don't want to be late and yada, yada, yada. So I was like, okay. So me and her was texting and everything. And son said, butter, you better get up and go on out there to vote. <laughs> so finally, um, I finally got myself up, got myself ready for work and everything. And I tapped on my daughter's door and I was like, oh, you going to vote? She was like, wait for me. So she jumped up which was her first time voting i'm a little upset i didn't take a picture of me and her together going to vote so um it was her first time so i missed out on that opportunity so we finally got out of the house so when i got to the school which is like kind of across the street from my house um we got in line and it it was dark and cold outside oh my god it was freezing my fingers were cold my feet were cold um, I had on this coat though, and um, my body was warm, but my fingers and my feet were freezing. So, anywho, um, I end up standing in the line for um, 40 minutes. So, I really am going to say a half an hour because I got there before um, the polls opened up at 6. So, I stood in line. I was talking to a couple of people in line. We're having good conversations and everything. And so the process was they asked you your name of your street. Um, then you went on either or side, wherever your street is. You give your name. But even before, so the lady was standing at the door and she asked you what street. And you tell her the street. And then it had hand sanitizer there already for you. So she pumps it in your hand and then you go inside. Um, give your name, etc., etc., And then you... Um, get your little ballot paper and your pencil i think i still have my pencil <laughs> and um um i did my little bubbles and um my daughter i explained it to my daughter and she did her situation and we went over there and put it in the machine and everything and we on our we got our um sticker and then we got our um exit pump of hand sanitizer which i thought was pretty good um i feel that they had a little bit more people in there that they should have but other than that i was okay i had my n95 mask on my daughter had her mask on so yeah it was a, a fairly good experience i just wish i would have taped i would have um vlogged um or or took a picture of me and my daughter but Tish didn't have such a great experience. When she got there, she had explained to me that the um, the printer wasn't working. And then the, some of the voters had to help the, um, the volunteers fix that. And then I guess after you vote, um, you know how you put it in a machine and it counts your vote. She was upset because then that machine was down and everything she just felt like it was so unorganized it was chaotic and then they had to leave their ballots behind and then um once they get the machine up and running 
um, they'll feed the machine. The, the volunteers, they will feed the machine. So she was upset. She said the whole point of her getting up early and she wanted to make sure that her vote really counted. And she really hopes that they did end up feeding the machine like they said they were. So she was like, if it was, she was going to go through all that, then she would have just um, did an absentee vote, a ballot vote, whatever. So, yeah. Um, so she didn't have such a great experience. She was a little bit frustrated with that this morning. But um, I said, all you can do is just hope and pray that they did count your vote. And that's all you can do. Or her other option was to come back after work. And you know, after work, how them lines be getting down. So she just went on with what she did. And she just have to hope and believe that they um, are going to do the right thing. But yeah, so that is my voting day. Let me know in the comments below if you had a good experience, a bad experience. How was the social distancing? Um, hand sanitizer. I mean, how did your experience go? <laughs> all right guys that's all i have for you today i will see you in the next vlog y'all already know butter is out tty um what can i say tty and i hope you had a good experience to the else <laughs> bye guys